Hey, <coughs> so I'm still suffering and healing from watching Chernobyl. Um, but as like before I watched it and after, I was reading Hellboy in Hell. I think I talked about this. And I just wish, like how come, how come like um, modern horror makers Move, movies how come they're not making stuff like mining Hellboy for like this supernatural gothic horror I mean it's amazing like reading this like I mean <coughs> it's Hellboy's wife reading this I just I mean I love I've always loved Hellboy and reading this I was like man what have I missed so, um, this is great. I got it from the library. So, um, I just was looking like, I got a few, um, I got a few Hellboy, like, comics. So I was just, well, actually I don't have that many right now, but I have this, uh, Hellboy in the BPRD, Her Fatal Hour and Ascending. And then I had, I bought this a while ago, the Koshche, the Headless. I remember I got, I have the, it's a six issue limited series. I got one, three, and six. So I need like two, oh, one, three. Yeah, I need like two, four, and five, which I just ordered. And, uh,. Man, what the hell? I didn't even see this. And it's got art by Ben Stenbeck, who is just, he's so good. He's nothing like Magnola. Like, and I first saw him on the Lord Baltimore, and he is so perfect. Like, his, I mean, I would like, he, I think he could draw anything, but he seems to be perfect like the horrors stuff and I uh, just requested the like all the Baltimore books I haven't read from the library and I have this Sir Edward Gray Acheron and and this is just a one issue like a, a one and done issue or like one and leading up to something else and it's about Sir Ed, Edward Gray who's another like man you got the DC Universe, you got Marvel, and I mean, I would, I'm gonna say that Magnolia's got the third best, well, yeah, the third best the universe and characters. He's got, he's got Hellboy, he's got Abraham Sapien, he's got Lobster Johnson, he's got, uh, God, I, um, he's got Sir Edward Gray, and he's got that guy that's a ghost in a suit. Um, and then just these weird characters in Acheron alone. Um, uh, like he has a whole world that he's created. Uh, or, I mean, he didn't create Rasputin, but he's he's um, a Magnola verse character to me now. Uh, I know he's got. Who else does he have? But, and this Koshche, I haven't read, like, or I may have read this first issue, but, you know, I, I need the whole story. Oh, uh, Lord Baltimore, too, like, just, and they're all, like, horror, uh, supernatural, fantasy, so. Um, yeah, this, like, reinvigorated my interest in Hellboy. Oh yeah, the amazing the amazing screw on head is another amazing character. Um it just makes me also makes me think like on the other end of the spectrum of horror, you got Richard Lehman who I think is just the best writer like of sick ass disturbing horror. Um I heard someone talking like 
I heard a, a podcast talking about like someone asking about good slasher books, and they really didn't know what they were talking about. I thought because they didn't talk about Layman, who like most of his books has like a slasher character in it or murder or killer, um, and his are they're always pretty much most of the most part they're human. He does have a few like, supernatural killers, but his guys are the, the worst. They're like. And they're just human, but they're so bad. Like, they're worse than... In some ways, they're worse than, like, Freddy, Jason, uh, Michael Myers, uh, Jigsaw, whoever else. Uh, Silent Night, Deadly Night. Like, his are down and dirty. But back to Hellboy, like... He's so much. Uh, and then visually, like, what they could do... With Hellboy material, um, I don't. You can't like. You can't totally recreate. Mag I love this uh, pick. I don't think you can recreate what Magnola does with his art, but you could maybe get the spirit somehow. I don't know. I don't know if they'll ever do anything like this, but. Um, yeah, this is really just like, I was like, man, I gotta tell someone about this. So, you have your local library, it's, it's right there. Uh, and uh, oh yeah, sh uh, shout out to Video Massacre on Instagram. I'm gonna see if, uh, right now, if the library has that True Detectives. And uh, yeah, check out <laughs> Chernobyl if you wanna uh, be depressed and sad for, if you want your day ruined. But then read some Hellboy and then you'll be happy again. Like, you, uh, the Hellboy hell is just a lot nicer than Chernobyl. So, and then this, reading this, Acheron was like, this kind of doesn't make sense, but it was good. He didn't care. Like, and it's almost saying, like, maybe he doesn't even need Hellboy anymore. But yeah, I just want to talk about. Uh, Hellboy and Mike Nola, so give him a chance.